Scientists say that the universe will soon begin to shrink significantly, which means that the corpus of the universe may occur much sooner than previously thought. Stay with us. Hello guys, welcome to Black Ocean Family. As you know, we're gonna talk about how far are we from the complete corpus of the universe. A scientific achievement published in journal Proceeding of the National Academy of Service shows that after nearly 13.8 billion years of uninterrupted expansion, the universe will soon experience a slow contraction, which means the corpus of the universe at an earlier time. It is more than what we imagined before. In this new research, three scientists attempt to model the nature of dark energy. Energy, the mysterious force that appears to be causing the universe to expand faster based on past observation of cosmic expansion. In the team's model, dark energy is not a fixed force in Asia, but an entire cold quintessence that can decline over time. The researchers found that even though the expansion of the universe has been accelerating for billions of years, the repulsive force of dark energy may be waking. So according to this scientist model, the universe acceleration could end rapidly in the next 65 million years than within. 100 million years the universe would stop expanding altogether and in a set inter period of slow contraction that would last billion of years. After that, it ends. Paul Sinhart, one of the authors of this study of the director, the Center for Theoretical Scientists at Princeton University in New Jersey, said this whole process can happen remarkably quickly. In a conversation with Life Science, he added, It was 65 million years ago that the Chinese club asteroid hit the Earth and whipped out the dinosaurs. Therefore, on a cosmic scale, 65 million years is a very short time. On the other hand, Gray Hinshaw, a professor of physics and astronomy at the University of British Columbia who was not involved in this study, told Life Science, Because this model depends only on past observation of the expansion, and because the current nature of dark energy in the universe it is still very complicated. It is impossible to measure the achievements of this research at this time. The mystery of dark energy in our universe. Since the 1990s, scientists have discovered that the expansion of the universe is accelerating, and that the space between galaxies is now expanding faster than it was billion of years ago. Scientists have called the mysterious source of this acceleration dark energy an invisible entity that appears to work against gravity pushing the universe's most massive object apart rather than bringing them closer together. Although dark energy accounts for approximately 70% of the total mass energy in the universe, it is properties remain a mystery. A popular theory proposed by Albert Einstein is that dark energy is a cosmic constant and unchancing form of energy woven into the fabric of space-time. If so, and the force extracted by dark energy can never change, then the universe must continue to expand and accelerate forever. However, a competing theory suggests that dark energy does not need to be consensed in order to be consistent with observation of past cosmic expansion. And it's a dark energy may be something called Quincy's a dynamic field that chance over time. Are we the end of the world? From that point on, one of two things could happen. Stein Hart said, either the universe contracts until it collapses in on itself in a big bang and end space time as well we know it, or the universe contracts enough to return to a state similar to its initial condition in a big bang another or a great labor curse, creating a new world from the ashes of the world or we can call it the old world. In the second scenario, the universe follows a cyclical pattern of expansion and contraction, crunch and bonus and constantly collapsing and rebuilding. Sinhart says, if this idea is correct, then our present universe may not be the first or the only universe, but the latest in the infinite stream of birth and death of universes that have expanded and contracted before ours. It all depends on the variable nature of dark energies. Since all of our observation of the cosmic expansion 
come from objects million to billion of light years away from Earth. Current data can only tell scientists about the universe's past, not its present or future. Hinshaw adds, Sinhad also acknowledged that unfortunately there is no good way to test this scenario or whether the cosmic expansion is starting to slow down. Therefore, this idea will still remain as a theory. Thank you guys for your watching. All this theory that we said, it is just a theory. If you have any idea, you can write it to comment for us. Here you are guys, we recommended movie and book fair today. I love you guys, take care of yourself, we'll see you tomorrow, for now goodbye.